I ask myself, why is the world of Henry Wright still popular today, 50 years later? You know, some people know all the dialogue, and they'll say it with me. And I think it's because it's a timeless story. Uh, two young girls who are teenagers growing up, not very popular, not a lot of friends, and they find each other, and they're coping with the kinds of things that I think kids cope with in every generation, uh, feeling lost, feeling lonely, wondering if they're good enough. Um, I think George Roy Hill was a fabulous director. He always used to say that Henry was his favorite movie, and I think there was a good reason for it. And then, of course, you have people like Peter Sellers who became icons, and the characters that they created are wonderful. If you listen to Henry Orient and listen to Peter's accent, it goes from Bulgarian to French to Italian to Brooklyn. It's very, I mean, he just was a master understanding how to create characters. And Henry Orient was not a one-sided character. He's a multifaceted, very funny, and very insecure artist. And then, of course, there are the hats. What do you think? I think it looks as good today as it did 50 years ago. Hmm?